What's going on guys? This is Jack Guzman, uh, Wild Force Black Ranger, aka Danny Delgado. Peace, love, Jordan. Hey guys, what's going on? Ranger Reviewer here. And today we're here in Alhambra, I hope I'm saying that right, in California. Uh, as you can see, we're at Nucleus, right there. Sick. Yeah, okay. Uh, it's more than time, a tribute to the Mighty Morphin Patterns official exhibition and comic launch party. Now, Nucleus is really awesome. They're a comic book store as well as an art gallery. We're in here right now. It's going to be really cool. Opening reception January 16th, which is today, 7 to 10 p.m. It is about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. We have some waiting to do, uh, but let's go. Let's go check outside and see what they have. Alright guys, we're inside and we have a little pop-up show. It's really cool. You guys can follow me a little bit. I'm just going to switch the camera so you guys can see it. There we go. So we got the uh, kind of looking, as you guys saw this from the, uh, what was it, the Halloween stores that were um, during Halloween, obviously. You have the Ranger Shades Mask things. Now we have a wider selection. We have the Black Ranger here. We have the Red Ranger. White Tiger. That's a little dirty. Yeah. We have the Green Ranger, the Pink Ranger, some of the Ninja stuff. The Ranger Steel. Ninja Steel, I'm sorry. We have a translucent uh, vinyl for subjects finals. We have the ones that are the, I believe, the San Diego Comic Con exclusives that we had before. Another translucent blue. Uh, we have Gokaiju, which is cool. This wasn't here before, was it? When we first came out here. I saw it maybe. 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 We flashed by real quick. Uh, we have the same things over here as a top. And then on the bottom, which is really cool, we have the shirts down here. We have uh, masses on. We have the powered up Red Ranger with the Green Ranger shield. And we have a really cool, interesting shirt with like all the Red Rangers and the putties. So, um, I think that's it for over here. Really cool new Bob Fox shirt that we brought in. I like this one. Will likes this one too. Yeah, I like that one a lot. That's really <laughs> nice. I never saw that one before. And just as I was saying, as I was saying before, we do have the shirt over here with all the putties and the rangers. So it's like green the issue rangers. one cover, isn't it? I believe so. Yes. Yeah. So that's cool. Yeah. And then another We Love Five shirt. <laughs> and the last one over here. Massive shout out to Trekkie who did design the shirt. Um, you guys want to follow him on Twitter? This is the what, one one one. one 19. Yeah. 119 heroes. Yeah, and then that's pretty much it for the He has an updated one which isn't on the website yet, but yeah, but this is the one that we will find. And then the last thing you want to look at. We have the really cool prints for about $40. We have uh, EQ, the EQE, or Angel Pink, or something like that. It's really nice, I like that one. And then Tamir, the White Ranger. We do have the available Green Ranger for the same price. That's really nice. You know, if you want to put them there. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. And these are all numbered. I just found out these are, this is 13, this is 7. And then behind this, we have the Green Ranger. Which is these are all numbered. Yeah. All numbered as well. So this is 10 out of 75. And then the big one, the big boy. These are all Green Rangers. Oh, we have some White Rangers too. I like this one a lot. Yeah, this is totally out of my price range. The uh, Megazord, which is nice. So there we go. But if you guys want to kind of peek a little bit, it's okay. So we have the uh, art gallery right here. Just kind of move that There's a giant green hot vinyl right there. There's just something on the Different types of areas you can see. They have covers from all the ranges in there too. And then we have a backdrop in the back. Kind of for all the writers and stuff, but they're still working on it. Like I said, they have about three hours, three hours, three or four hours to go. It's gonna be a long uh, wait, but here we go, guys. Hope you guys. All right, guys. So we're gonna try on one of these shirts. This is the Red Ranger with uh, the dragon shield on. This looks really sick, really cool. So that looks awesome. I'm gonna try it right now, and I'm gonna purchase this if it works. So let's go. 
All right, guys, here we go. This is the medium in the Red Ranger, powered up Red Ranger shirt. I like it, it's very nice. Go step away from me, guys. I'm like a Zoolander thing. It kind of works out because the, right. the proportions are right. like, go exactly with you. Except the helmet's like really big, but. Just kidding. Yeah, the helmet is a bit big, but other than that, if you pan down for a little bit, the, the belt buckle is really nice. Yeah, everything sits kind of like, where it's supposed to. And for twenty dollars, honestly, I think this is one of the better shirts, uh, considering that like the hot topic ones are like what twenty dollars. So. Yeah, it's also very unique. So. And it's very unique. I, I think because it's like a Boom Studios thing, I'm definitely gonna grab this. So this fits well. Um, it's a little tight up top, but you know it's not that bad. So I'm gonna grab this. It's probably thing, the only thing I'm gonna buy. The comics can wait, but who knows? Uh, we're gonna be in line for about six hours, so let's go try it. One hour later. We have a line! It's actually quite long too. Take you guys around. Zoom back in here. Jaywalk, of course. With one hour and four minutes left. Yeah, that book has been there since one. Like two? Like two? Like two? Like two? Like two? You're going to
Jason Fon arrives. Jason Fon is in the building. But he arrives so late. So we're just gonna chill and see what we're gonna do. The Green Ranger's there. Oh, where's the rest of the Ranger? Little so backdrop. He's got seven. We got the White Ranger and the Green Ranger one. How tough was it to find these? It was not that hard. Really? Yeah. You just got to know people and then talk it's to them. Expensive. Yeah, I would imagine that's why. But those look absolutely beautiful, guys. Yeah. I'm, su I'm surprised they don't have any here, but whatever. I know. But it's whatever. Thank you guys so much. You guys look great in line right behind us. <laughs> Thanks for waiting. All right, guys, as we're winding now, they actually put out more prints than we had before. Uh, we have an JDF poster, which is really interesting. You see this, the JDF? Uh, yeah, he has yeah. like all his stuff. And they're like all his tattoos and belt buckle with the yeah. Geo Star PowerPoint. That's okay, a, that's a thing. And we got uh, this White Ranger one, which is really nice. I kind of like it because it's just it's a skinnier version of what we see from uh, previous ones. I think. And then we got the Dragon Flute. Um, Green Ranger, to like mirror that pretty much if you want to have them displayed right next to each other. But uh, yeah, we just met. Wait for it, guys. We just met uh, Jason Fong. We spoke to him, took a real quick picture. Uh, Erin Cahill was here, but we, she's been talking nonstop, so I didn't want to bother. And uh, Cameron Gibo took a picture with him. Really nice dude. Uh, talk to him real quick. And I think that's it, but we also met Black Hair Comedy, Andre, right? He's in the right Bruno and Mia are upstairs chilling. I want to see if I can talk to them. We should actually probably do that. But other than that, it's been a great experience. And if I end the video here, I don't, I'm not, not sad at all. It's a great experience. Good morning, everyone. It is uh, the day after today. It's the 17th, I believe. Um, I don't know why it's all weird. I don't know. But uh, shout out to Rathy for getting me this BB-8. There you go. Force Awakens shirt from Uniqlo Japan. I'm not sure if Uniqlo America has it. Uniqlo is pretty much like a Gap, but like the Japanese version. like it a lot better than Gap, in my opinion. So I'm exhausted. I'm about to head out anyway. Uh, so this is what... I pretty much got from um, the whole uh, release party. So this is the Boom Studios bag that the comics came in. Um, people have been wondering about the shirt. Bruno was actually quite confused about the shirt as well. Um, this is the armored, powered up Red Ranger shirt. Now, as you can see, we got the Dragon Dagger over here, um, Dragon Zord over here, and then you know, obviously the shield and then Red Ranger stuff. Um, so, I don't know if Boom Studios is going to release this anywhere else, or whoever's going to carry these. I don't think they'll be in Hot Topic. Uh, there's the tag right there, and then Logo Vision is um, the inner tag. Uh, but this was $20. Um, like I said, if you find this for like a good price, I would definitely grab it, because it's definitely one of my favorite ones. And this was, uh, I think this is better, a better shirt than those uh, that are selling at uh, hot Topic, the diamond ones, the usual. Um, so if I had a choice, I'd definitely get this one instead. Um, the Black Ranger and the all the Rangers fighting the putties are were pretty much almost all sold out last night. Um, when we left at like eight o'clock, uh, we only stayed there for an hour. Like these ones were gone. I'm pretty sure the only ones I saw were on the mannequin. I think. Um, from wearing the shirt, I uh, uh, the I think the Power Rangers. Um, public relations people like uh, giving belts uh, out. Uh, Will has one, but Will didn't actually win it. Uh, Rafi actually got it, and then he gave it to him. 
Um, so there is mine. That's my belt. I don't know if I'll actually wear it. Maybe if I completely nerd out one day and just decide to wear everything Power Rangers. Um, oh, this will definitely be worn at Power Rangers. Don't get me wrong. And then... Uh, for like the first hundred people, they gave oh, they gave away these um, mash mashems. Yeah, I don't really care. I actually got um, I got blue samurai ranger, but I gave that to Will for reasons. But here are the awesome comics. This is what we were there for six hours for. And you might be thinking, well, you only got four, right? No, I actually got five. So they they were actually packaged. Double. These were packaged together. I have to get some more uh, back and um, some sleeves and boards uh, later for uh, for these two or whatever. Um, Pink Ranger comes by herself, and you can get fifteen percent off from using Boom Fifteen for the uh, Gallery Nucleus. Pretty cool. So here is the Pink Ranger. These are beautiful. I actually just peeked inside to see what the artwork was looking like, and it looks amazing. Like so much better than the. Um, Who's the, I, I forget, Paper Cuts version, so much better. These are beautiful. I love these. I can, I'm going to frame these, and then um, and probably in the near fu in the future, when I have my own place, I will definitely hang these up. So, uh, we did get to meet the writers, and what I like to do with people that I've met, because I usually don't resell my stuff, I like to make them personable, or at, like one-of-one -one stuff. So, for the Black Rangers, uh, who do we have? Uh... So here we go. We have one of the writers here. So just saying, and their signature. And they got a lot of arrows on there. They did this. They did this in uh, silver sh sharpie. And then we got. I think this is pretty sure this is Kyle Higgins in this one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So and then this one is to Chris, my number two fan. Don't ask why I did my number two fan. That was my cell phone, but whatever. So, there's their signature, I got them on the black and red rangers. I'll probably get another one just to keep uh, another black and red ranger, uh, because I want to have it so, at least, uh, yeah, what do I, what do I want to do? I, I'm like blanking out right now. Um, wow, just to keep like two of them fresh, so like n with nothing on them, so yeah, that's what I want to do. Uh, but they're sold out everywhere, but apparently there a lot of places are getting more in next week. So that's pretty good. I wish they made this one a cover. This is actually really awesome. Maybe at the end, end of the series or something, but these are fantastic. They look fantastic. I'm actually probably going to try to read one before I head out and like get ready to head out because I'm in some pajamas. So there we go. Absolutely beautiful. Um, it was a crazy, let me, let me get lighting. It was a crazy awesome event. Um, at the end where we were about to leave, I actually got recognized for the first time, um, by one of our fans. And what was it? Manuel? Was it Manuel? I'm, I'm like, like, yeah, I'm so tired. I'm, I'm sorry for, forgot your name. I think it was Emmanuel though. Um, he recognized me, said peace lives order. I was like, what? And, uh, it was so, so surreal for that to happen. He got recognized because I, I, I never thought it would happen. I was telling Will, if I ever get recognized, I had to take a, a picture with that person because, yeah, it's it's so like it's the moment thing. Like you don't, you never think about these happening, but you get recognized sometimes. That's weird. But if you ever do recognize me, like in in person, don't be hesitant to like come up to me because I, I'm like one of you guys. I don't, I'm not special. I just do videos and. They get views. It, it, it all just happens. So, yeah. Um, just come up to me. I don't care. I, if I'm not busy, just don't be rude about it. Because if I'm talking or if I'm, like, busy, just wait for, like, five seconds or five minutes. And then, you know, come up to me. Because, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't like to be, you know, pestered or anything like that. So, thank you guys for being awesome, by the way. A really great event, like I said before. If you have one of these in your area, definitely try to do one of them because I've never been to a, a, a release party and that was awesome. That was really awesome. And the actors, the people that were there, it was fantastic. And I love like the art gallery scene. That's cool. I used to go to museums when I was back in Philadelphia. So uh, that was really, really like very familiar feeling. You know, I kind of missed it. So there we go, guys. I've been rambling too much. That was like a 20 minute video. So. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Peace, love, Zordon. Deuces.